Well, Natalie, the first thing is you want to have a glove on so you don't slip and cut your hand and a proper oyster knife. Ours are not sharp, a little pointed edge, but you still need to be careful so you don't harm yourself. Best way to do it is point the back of the oyster or the hinge of the oyster facing towards you. You stick the knife in until it can't go anymore and you give it a pop, just like that. And you want to slide your knife on the top plate of the oyster to cut that abductor muscle. It opens and closes that oyster. Throw it to the side, scrape the other abductor muscle, and it's ready to go. Back to you, Natalie.